What up, it's Melvin7 here and EA, by the looks of it, have released an absolute shit ton of content. Um, I'll have a bunch of icon upgrades, uh, sorry, prime icon packs and um, upgrade packs later in this video and maybe throughout the week. You know, it, it's a nice period of grinding. Obviously, everyone's going to pick this Kent card because... His 84 was so ridiculous. Uh, I'm just going to discard that though because obviously it's the one you vote for and I, uh, it's pointless keeping the loan. But anyhow, um, that's that done. Uh, let's move on to the SBCs. Just to, you know, I've had a little look on Twitter to see, see what's came out, but it does look like there's a lot. So there's this for a 25k pack, which I will have done and, uh, you know, it'll be later in the video. Uh, marquee matchups, which also look pretty good. Um, some good packs for a change. I love those packs. The small rare gold players is six cards, uh, six gold, six rares. Um, 15k pack, a 12.5 and a 25. And what do you get overall? Is it a mega pack? 35k pack. Nice. A 15k pack for a cheap marquee moments, I'm presuming. I hope anyway. Um, 75 rated with two brick slots. Uh, you're probably looking at about a 78 rated squad. That's not too bad. Is it tradable? It's tradable. That's good. Um, as I say, from what I, I saw, this was apparently decent. I'm just going to see what the requirements are. Oh, okay, that's really good. It's 78 raid with no chem. Yeah, perfect. Um, but obviously, they're not the main attractions. It's uh, these, the 81 plus packs, which are going to be pivotal for the Icon SBC. Um, 11 rares, 50 chem. Yeah, that's just standard really, isn't it? Uh, 82 to 88, this will probably be 7 golds, yep, 45 chemistry, yep, it's the same thing they released during Team of the Season, that's fair enough, um, but they're going to be useful for this, this is what everyone's quite hyped about, I've had a couple of um, subs that have showed me their packs, one of them got Pele, the other one got Hullet, so you know, they seem to be giving out, so 88 rated, 55 chemistry in a Team of the Week moments or Team of the Season, that's... That's really good. That's honestly really good. It's going to be a good period of grinding and I'll try and get as many of those done as we can. We'll try and get the Kent card done at some point next week whenever that comes out. It's not going to be Jovic or Musa. Nobody's going to vote for them unless you're, you know, a specific fan of that player. But come on, Kent's going to win. I will get this Endombele done as well and we'll make our way through the Footmas Mendy and fit champs in somehow but anyhow it gives it you know the game a reason to actually grind to do something uh, to play it so yeah without further ado it's probably a bumper pack episode so enjoy but anyhow uh, so yeah i've got a bunch of packs um we'll just start off with these really so you know we've got a twitch prime 2 uh, which is good uh, anyone who doesn't know uh, yeah if you've got twitch prime uh, which you know you can get uh, through Amazon Prime you get like free packs on FIFA and yeah the latest one gives you an 83 overall at least which is good there he is yo Kieran cheers for joining the stream appreciate it the game has already screwed me over today lost to a guy who was terrible due to, <laughs> due to bad gameplay that just sounds like FIFA man that sounds like foot champs oh we're up to nine viewers shit man Hello to everyone in the chat. Oh, wow, we're, we're doing well with these 81 plus packs uh, so far. Sorry, these aren't 81 plus. These are the 82 to the 88. So, oh God, is he an untradeable duplicate? No, good. Okay, so an 84 and an 83. Hey, redeeming some of the emotes. I like it. I like it. I can't wait. I literally cannot wait until I can make all my emotes tier one instead of making some of them tier two and tier three. Wow, we've got another board. Oh shit, that's a special card. Is that a headliner? Yo, is that guy? Yo, from an 82 to an 88. That is good. Shapeshifter's guy. Okay, gay guy, whatever. You know who it is. PSG centre back. Well, he's a centre mid, but obviously this card is centre back. I know he goes for absolutely nothing, but yeah, considering the pack. That you build him costs 2k, I think. Something like that to, to build one of these um, 82 to 88. That's great. I can definitely put him in for an icon pack. If anyone in the chat has any icon... Oh, wow, another board. Shit, these are paying out. If anyone has any icon packs that they do want me to open for them live on stream, I'll be absolutely delighted to do that. 
Uh, can you believe it's been four years in September since uni fella mental? Oh, Kieran. Oh, Kieran. Bo hey, yo, I know, man. All my days. Makes me feel old. Like, I did my MA and it, it's, it's nearly been a, a year since I completed that too. It's absolutely insane. Holy shit. How you been anyway, Kieran? And uh, that's how I did the icon pack. Did loads of 82 to 88. It's got Kimmich in four, Marquinhos, Slabhead, 86. Yo, another... Oh, I thought it was Vidal. Okay, that's an 83, but yeah. Hey, how's it going? Yo, Rasmus. Cheers for joining the stream. No problem, boy -o. <laughs> Hey, getting a good chat going here. Yeah. Might even hit the 10 chatters, which is a, a, a thing on Twitch, but yeah. Shit, started uni in 2015, ended in 2019. Shit, all of these have been boards, man. Like, this is good. I know obviously the minimum is 82, but every time I've opened these in other promos, they've just been literally 82s. Uh, so, you know, that'll be great. I'll be able to get the end on Belly SBC done. Uh, yo, cheers for joining the stream, Dan, using those Twitch emotes. All right, there we go. I've been bragging about these bloody packs, and there we go. We got our first 82. That's about normal, isn't it? Jesus, Navas. Oh, my fucking... No, you didn't. Piss off. You got... What? You got Prime R9. Oh, my fucking God. Mate, send me a DM on Twitter. I'll show that on stream. Uh, are you excited about football coming back tonight? Fuck yeah, man. Fuck yeah. It's been 99 days since, you know... Uh, since I can, you know, watch United chill and just, yeah, of course I'm fucking excited. And it's a big game as well, Spurs. Another top six contender. Fuck you, Tom. <laughs> I'll allow that one in the chat, don't worry. <laughs> nah, joking. Oh, mate. Oh. Yeah, you got me again. You baited me again. It's absolutely ridiculous. I mean, United, of course. Yeah, boy. Hey, we've got some GGs in the chat. I like it. I like it. And we've got Herodiki. Is that twice in a row? <sighs> Fuck's sake. Yeah. Come on, man. I just gassed you. No, that sounds... Gassed you up. Just, just leave that. I didn't say that. Um, anyway, uh, premium will open now. I literally haven't been this excited for a game in ages. Yeah, man, same. Same. Like, it, it, it feels... Well, it practically is, like, over the summer. Like, when there's no international football tournament going on. And you've got absolutely no football. It's good, man. All right, these are tradable, so it would be nice to, you know, get some coins. Uh, Thorsby, you might as well discard him. 1-1. One, one. You genuinely think it's going to be 1-1? One, one. What? Really? We're at home. Come on, man. You're, in, you're a United fan. We're unbeaten in 10. 1-1. One, one. Seriously? And then all of August, we may go on a European tour. True. Wow, Dan, you think 1-1 one, one as well. Shit, man. Nah, I, I genuinely think it'll be like 3-0 or 3-1. I know Kane and Son are back and all that shit, but e even even with them, I don't know, Spurs weren't on great form, were they? I know form kind of goes out the window when you haven't been playing for three months, but 3-1 Man United, there we go, and that's from a Newcastle fan. I'll take that. Also, you are away, not at home. Oh, bloody hell, man. I can't even... Yeah, you're right, of course. Oh. Yeah, I'm just excited, okay? I'm excited. <sighs> Can it formulate things in my head? We are away. Yeah, we are. I'm, uh, I mixed it up with the Sheffield United game. I thought we were away at Sheffield United and home at Spurs. But it's the other way around, isn't it? Yeah. Oh, well. That went well. E hey. Let's see if I've missed any other uh, comments. I wish bro I got who you all remember. Yeah, I remember you, you said. I didn't know if you'd done another one though. Uh, what about the Norwich game? Oh. Yo, cheers for the follow, Hagen. I appreciate that. Hey, he's one of the people I will be playing Warzone with later, uh, Hagen. I, I know him well. Norwich 2-2. Two, two. All right, Norwich play today. Yeah. Oh, who's this? Is this a high rated Connor Ball? Yo, I'll take that in 87. I can throw him in uh, or discard him if I need some, some coins. That's not bad. I'm excited for this Twitch Prime pack. I've seen a lot of people get some decent things in there. Yeah, he's about 20 odd K. I'll store him in the club. Norwich 2 2. Hmm. 
Who are Norwich playing? I haven't. Oh, oh no. <laughs> I'm excited about football returning, but it's primarily United. <laughs> Hence why I've started this at 3 to 7, so I'm not actually sure who Norwich play. Oh, I was hoping that would be a glitched uh, headliner or something. Right, but oh, no one cares. Best thing about packs is you nearly get a special card every big pack. Yeah, true. Southampton at home. Ooh. Oh, that, that's got nil-nil written all over it, I think. How many of these do we have? Oh, we've got... Uh, hey! Cheers for the follow, Kieran. Appreciate that. Southampton. Yeah, I reckon that's got nil-nil written all over it. What about everyone else in the chat? 2 on Norwich, in my opinion. Yeah, weren't Norwich on a decent run of form before all this shit kicked off as well? They were starting to, like, climb off the bottom of the... The league. Also, what fixtures are tomorrow? I think Chelsea play on Sunday. What are you playing with Hagen for? He sucks. That, that that is true, Dan. But you know, I I do like giving back to the community, and yeah, he's one of the people I can give back just by you know sharing my immense skills at Warzone with him. And Mark too. Mark is going to make an appearance. Uh, who so kindly donated five subs yesterday. And subbed himself, which was mad, right? But anyhow, uh, yeah, I'll leave the Twitch Prime pack for last. And then, as I say, might have two Prime Icon packs. Who knows? Who knows? And if anyone wants me to open theirs, I can do that live on stream. Brighton versus Arsenal tomorrow. <laughs> oh, that's a walkout. French? Go on, be Pogba. So, is that Griezmann? Ah, oh, Benzema, okay. Can't believe you're leaving me out. Well, maybe, Dan, I don't know. You know... I, I gotta spread it. I gotta spread the love in it. I, I can't. I can't just uh, do the same thing all the time. But um, Brighton versus Arsenal. Brighton two one. Uh, let's be honest. Arsenal have no defenders. They're all injured or banned. Uh, Watford Leicester. I, mm, Leicester were kind of struggling before this kicked off as well, weren't they? They were starting to slip a little bit. Oh, wrong centre mid. So. Uh, what for, you'd expect Leicester to win, but I wouldn't be surprised to be a to be a draw pure chin. <laughs> I like that, Dan. West Ham Wolves. You'd imagine Wolves had had beat West Ham there two one probably. Bournemouth Crystal Palace. Think Palace were doing well prior. I go Palace. I think two two nil. Ryan Fraser's left as well, hasn't he? He's uh, not playing for Bournemouth anymore. Not signing a, a mini extension. Arsenal have no defenders <laughs> when they're all fit. True, they probably prefer when they're injured, when it's Mustafi or David Luiz anyway. Oh my god, that was comical. What a return to the Premier League that was. Sheffield United get a goal that's like two yards into the net, doesn't get given, and then Arsenal do an Arsenal, and just Arsenal, pretty much. Draw for the Palace game, nil-nil, I reckon. You could be right. You could be right. Again, it's, it's so hard to judge what's going to happen. Because, you know, you don't know how people have been coping with the new training regimes. Uh, you know, whether they're, they're worried for out external factors, that sort of thing. You know, it's it's really, really difficult to tell. Oh, here we go, Ronaldo, boys. Obviously not, I know it's not, but... <sighs> Andre Silva, the troll everyone hates. It's mad to think about how far ahead Arsenal we are when you take it player by player for the squad. True, true. I, I would agree with that. I reckon that we are quite far ahead. I think everyone in the top six is far ahead of Arsenal, to be honest. Eh, another board, you know. The, the, these will help for the end on belly. That was English, I think, so hopefully it's Walker, Stones. That That's great. I've got Otamendi, so, you know, it'll get a chemistry thing for the end on belly. But, yeah, we will have at least one prime pack. If not two. And from people who've tweeted me all their stuff, it's, it's looking pretty juiced. I did watch a few videos that weren't that good, but I've been tweeted someone who got Prime Hullet, someone who got, well, it's pointless saying Prime because they're all Prime. So someone got Hullet, someone got Eusebio, someone got Pele. You know, th these are just people I know as well. So I don't know about the rest of the community, it's ridiculous. Obviously, Tom got PR, which isn't good. Newcastle versus uh, Newcastle Sheffield on Sunday, 2-1 I think. That one's a tough one to call as well. 
Well, I presume because you put Newcastle first, they'll be at home. So you know, yeah, you could you could win. That that's that's one of those fixtures that I would just personally for me, I'd stay away from betting because it I I just don't know. You, you never know which Newcastle is going to turn up, particularly at home. And then Sheffield United are quite a strong team, but I don't know. It, it's it's a tough one. Oh wow! Oh wow! Inform Cruz. Yo, shit, 89 rated in form. That's probably the highest rated in form I've packed all year. I don't bet on Newcastle very often. Yeah, well, that's probably wise. Chef looked poor against Villa. They did, they did, but obviously they still should have won because of that BS um, glitch with, uh, what's it, Hawkeye, the name of the technology they use. Yeah, I, I, you know what, I'll say draw. I'm still not going to bet on it, but I'll, I'll say draw with that one. Maybe 1-1. One, one. Uh, how, how do you think your forward line will fare? Solid team, but there was no end product. True. What do you think of that combined 11 I just said? Oh, Arsenal, United combined 11. Leno, Wambasaka, Maguire, Bailly, Shaw, Pogba, Fred, Bruno, Rashford, Martial, Aubameyang. On current form, yeah, probably. Leno was the only good player uh, for Arsenal in the last game. Uh, kept it from being a cricket score. I know that's cliche, but it's true. Um, and Aubameyang obviously you know I mean he, he's got a good chance of being top scorer so you can't really not put him in but yeah other than that personally as a United fan I don't want anyone else in Arsenal so I, I'd probably agree with that one uh, is that Quadrado? okay 83 that's not too bad we've still got the player pick in the prime pack I don't think Jolington looked very sharp in training and friendly matches so hopefully you can take that into the season Oh, sorry, I think Joel... <laughs> I was going to say, what? You hope he's not going to be fit. All oh, right, he's, he's looked sharp in training. Yeah, well, you know, this this could be, like, the story, the start of him. Like, I look at Fred, for example. Like, he came into the Premier League and he was terrible first season. Absolutely shit. Couldn't do anything. And then second season, you know, he actually integrated well. And, yeah, he's one of our best players this season. Jolington might thrive with no fans, less pressure psychologically. That's good for him. True. Some players do. So Some players, you know, all they need is a confidence boost, really. And, yeah, you're right. It might ha it might happen for him. Might be worth sticking a little bet on that because you'll probably get decent odds. I know I said I don't bet on Newcastle, but ugh, you never know. I was going to say, if I've got an 83, 88, I'll take that. That's not bad. Again, I'll just throw him into the icon. Hey, Mark using this, uh, the emotes. But anyway, fuck it. We've dawdled for enough. So let's open this prime icon pack. Most of the chat thinks I'll get something good. No one said a Brazilian player. So I'd practically take any Brazilian other than Rivaldo. He's not very good. So let's see. What have we got? Oh, fuck off. Any, uh, it's Butraguin. Mm. I mean, he's not bad. He's not bad. He's just one of those that I don't really want to use. What are we saying? Is that a win? Is that an L? I don't know. I mean, value-wise, that's actually a big win. Hmm, okay, I thought he was a bit cheaper than that, in fairness. Maybe I'm being ungrateful. I don't know. I don't know. I suppose I could play around with him. Called it. Yo, did you say Butre? You did. Hey, fair play, man. You got it right. What are we saying? Should I keep him? See if I can build another one. What am I doing? Oh, yeah. Fuck it. We're just going to submit that. And then, yeah, I can use Guy in the other one. Right. Screw it. Prime icon. Here we go. There's no one there that I particularly care about. Um, yeah. There we go. Right. This is my second, probably final Prime icon pack for now. Just because I want to try and get the end on Bele completed and at least try and have the facilities to do Kent. But anyhow. Right. Are we all done with uh, who, who we think we're getting? Most people think it's going to be pretty good, to be honest. James Milner said the same thing when they won the Champions League. <laughs> True. Yeah, Vieira. You said Vieira again, so yeah. I take it. You see Bjorn and Cruyff are the two that I really want, though, because I've never used them other than draft. So let's do it. Let's do it. Again, if anyone wants me to open their prime eye compact, then by all means, just let me know, and I will. Come on, please be a decent flag. Netherlands, Brazil, Portugal. Is that Maradona? Oh! Oh, is that Maradona? Holy 
shit, we just got Prime Maradona. Yo. Yo, that's a big dub. Fucking hell. Holy shit, never gonna happen, Sanjay. Big Puyol inbound. Well, that doesn't look like Puyol. Shit. I've never really used him either. Like, is he actually good on FIFA? That's a big dub. Fucking hell, he's a mil and a half? Shit. Please refer... Oh, I need the chem. Still, though, yeah, I'm excited to use that, but we'll see if we can get Ndombele. Uh, we've got 44k, so yeah, I'm sure I'll be able to figure out a way to, to get that sorted. I think if Pogba's bench, we'll start with Bruno, Scott and Fred. Me too, although we might go for a slightly safe option and put um, Matic in for the YouTube video. But there we go. That's the squad that we're trading in. Not too bad. Let's just do it. Jumbo Premium Gold Pack. That's a 15k in it, so... You never know, could be something in there, but 93 rated Tangai in Dombele, who looks absolutely insane. Nearly everyone I've came up against on Champs today has got this card. I came up against someone who actually had the 93 Mendy. Like, I couldn't believe it. I beat him. Like, I beat him 6-2, but yeah, he must have ground his arse off for that. It's ridiculous. There we go. Tangai in Dombele, finally, after... Saying I'm going to get him for God knows how long. Right, let's open this 15k pack. And then I might I might do a couple more upgrade packs, you know. Why not? Get them uh, underway. Oh, it's a rare. Go on. Oh, get in. It's a walkout. Come on. Go on, be Neymar. Ah, uh, okay. Yo, that's good. 88 rated. That's brilliant for the Ryan Kent. Or oh, if I do another icon. That's fantastic. I'll take that. Can't complain. Oh, wow. And Klasson, who I might as well discard, because, yeah. I mean, he's discard value. I'm never going to need a man of the match, so I'll discard him. <gasps> Winning games, but only just against players I should beat. Oh, that sounds AIDS, man. Right, we've got a Champions League card. Hopefully that's an 83. 82. Nacho Fernandez, well, not too bad. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I'm just addicted. You have hooked me. At 5 0 in good gameplay. Hmm. Hey, there we go. Right, I'm just opening these last few packs, mate, and then I'll be on. <laughs> oh, na, na. What's my name? Yeah, boy. Oh, back up to nine viewers. Hey. Another reward? Okay, it's a Champions League walkout, so. Belgian centre back. Yo, I'll take that. Is that Alderweireld or Vertonghen? V Alderweireld. Not bad. Not bad. It's gonna help with a help with a Ryan Kent SBC. That will be released soon. Yeah, they've certainly buffed the 82s to 88s. Like most of the time in other promos, I was literally getting 82s. There's another special. This looks like a one to watch, so it's probably crap. Oh, delict. Yo, that's not bad. Is he 85? He's 88. Fuck. Man, that's... Uh, yeah, because, of course, he's had some informs. Yo, back-to-back -back mad cards there. An 87 and then an 88. Wow. Those packs are really paying out. Wow. Huh. And then we've got another board. And another special card. What the fuck? What's this? Oh, is that the... 85, I think he is. 84. Oh, okay, right. Still, it's an 84, and it's a special card. Not too bad. Three special cards in a row from these packs, though. Damn, they are paying out. And then we end with an 82 for them. Right, I've got two 81 plus packs, and then what's on it is, boys. End off with a cover search, right. Last two packs, come on, these don't have a limit, so you know, give us something good. Right, it's a board. It's not a walkout, so it's an 85 max, fares. Kadira and Guerrero, ugh. The other packs were better than them. Shit. Right, last one. It's not even a board, is it? 
Oh my god, right, the 81s stay away from. The 82 to 88s, definitely worth it. Right, there we go.